synonyms are fairness, peace, and respect. So let's play it. The second graders at Williamson Elementary School in Youngstown are pumping up their vocabulary, hoping to become like one of their teachers. Experience showing knowledge. We have a picture of that's a wise. That teacher at someone who is wise. The first step in this English language arts lesson is completing a paper graphic organizer with a definition, synonyms, and sentence. Then comes the fun part going online with the school's filtered internet to search for an image that illustrates the word. Wonder Woman is steering. With an app called Clips, the children mix their voices with images, backgrounds, and special effects to produce a video dictionary that is uniquely theirs. When they're able to apply what they're doing and have that creative freedom, it kind of, it's something that sticks in their head and they can reference it and then they have that, that clip image or video and they could say, you know, let's play it again and let's see that it's always there to kind of refer to. These guys are going to a grade where they have to test on technology. So any kind of exposure they get to using it and applying their learning through it is a benefit. We like learning with our iPad because it's more easy and it's like fun to do stuff. When the children first began using the app, the projects were very basic. Now they delve deeper into both the technology and integrating content from other subject areas. We can put extra stuff to make it more interesting. They go into pictures and words behind and very detailed uh, choices as to how to express uh, what they want to say. Even today, one of the kids had the word wealthy. They put an image of a person and then they put emojis where the money was coming out of the pocket and the other student said it looks like a see-through pocket where you can see the money coming out. So it's kind of funny to... Referencing Bill Gates. And curious. The student said that someone else was curious about Anne Frank. So applying those different skills. Things they've already learned about this year or people they've learned about. And go to the library and then... Student collaboration with okay, teacher so assistance okay. only when needed fosters a sense of independence. And, and sometimes when you work by yourself, it, it's kind of hard. Teamwork. And it's kind of created a culture in our, in our classrooms and in our school um, of caring and how to you know, help others and uh, use what you're good at with somebody else and to what they're good at to help you. Wade Warner and Dina Esmail encourage teachers to try different technology in various content areas. A lot of times we'll come across something that we think looks good. We'll ask the kids, hey, do you want to you want to try this out? And of course they say yes. And uh, you can kind of go from there if it works in your class or not. Um, and like you saw, that it, that it keeps them very engaged in what's going on. So. They're eager to do just about anything. Yes, so. correct. Yeah. Let's do this. I'm going to pick this one. There is also pride in sharing their work at school and at home. There we go, that you saw our video. We get to walk around and show other kids our work. That's the fun thing about the, being here. Or, or the teachers can just send it. That's why we like being here, because we do fun things. So, so this time we're both. The, the end. end. The end. The end.